Now, <laughs> the brown bag saga. <laughs> if you need to be caught up, Joho and who was the other politician? Um, I don't know. The important part is Joho. Joho yeah. <laughs> they went to Dubai with um, um, to visit Raila, who was um, hospitalized there. And a picture was taken with a brown bag. We went first of all to Betty Charlo. It wasn't Betty Charlo. Everyone started saying it was Natalie. And it was very speculative. But I feel like the evidence that has been brought to us by BNN hey. is enough to conclude that it's Natalie. <laughs> Number one, the brown bag. Number two, her visa. <laughs> they got her visa. Number three, she's been tagging Dubai everywhere she goes on her stories on her location everything and here's the thing yeah there are no international flights leaving Kenya yeah. legally currently so if you've left Kenya within the last how long it must have been on a private mm. flight or one that's not documented by anyone else mm -hmm. and then the time period which she's gone has been coincident the exact same amount of time yeah. as Joho, yeah. Natalie has not come out to say anything herself. Person, she has not come to confirm me, but I think there is more than enough evidence to say it's hers. Is it her bag? Yep, it's, it's her, her bag. bag. We got the it's receipt. Her bag. Did you look at the stories? The, if you've seen the stories, Yo. like they they confirm that it is. People zoomed in. They yeah. sent us notes. I mean, okay, yeah. You know, I yeah. think it is. What I find like the sad part is, mm. um, if because uh, you can date Joho if you want. He's mm. like a Muslim. You can have a million wives. As okay, not a million. It's supposed to be four wives. Yeah, I'm, yeah. Like, exaggerating. Mm. Technically, if they were having a relationship, it's not a bad thing. Technically, yeah? Yeah. But also, if she didn't want it to be known and wants to keep my relationship private, she wouldn't have been tagging the location. No. She wouldn't have been saying all these things. I think there's a part of her who, which really loves drama and mm. loves being, uh, um, being seen mm. and loves being talked about, but she's never going to go out and say it. So she's not going to be like, okay, hi, Dubai, because that makes you look like a certain type of person. Mm -hmm. But at the mm. same time, if she now puts the location there and everything, we're gonna, she's letting us know without letting us know. She's just there dropping crumbs. crumbs. Exactly. Yes. Yeah. And I feel sad for that because like if I was there doing something like that and I didn't want people to know genuinely, I wouldn't have posted it. There's yeah. no way I'm doing something like that and I, I want it to be private mm. and you guys know about it. There's but no way. But she's supposed to be doing um, Dubai on a budget, right? So here's the thing, yeah. The <laughs> irony of that is which budget when you went on a private flight, which budget, mm -hmm. you know? Um, so I feel like her content creator in her is not allowing her to keep this quiet you know like she's got a show where she's at apparently they went to this like um, a this like you know very high-end tea place you know like she yeah. her content creator the one who wants mm -hmm. us people to see what how she's living and what she, that person in her is not allowing her to keep her mouth shut and just be quiet because had she just kept quiet with her brown bag and yeah. continue posting as normal nobody would even suspect her yeah but she's got to be seen as the girl who's flying out to dubai i completely agree you yeah. know you have like a little angel here and a little demon here yep. it's like post that picture she's like no post yeah. that picture i don't think so that's exactly what happened yeah <laughs>